Hello, I am making this video here to review my most recent purchase that I'm very excited about here with my fly tying desk. Um, I've been very interested in tube flies and tying tube flies, I'd say, for the last five years. Um, I'm not a big steelhead fisherman or coho salmon or anything like that, but in the Midwest, I thought it might be kind of cool for smallmouth bass, pike, that type of thing, largemouth bass. But I didn't really want to have to spend all the money for a dedicated tube fly vise when I have my old trusty Regal right here. So instead, I purchased this Stonefo tube fly adapter um, that fits really in just about every vise that is made out there. Uh, if you look at it here, it's got this cutout relief right here with this little flange that just slips right into the vise. Um, the way it's made here, it's really kind of like a drill chuck. Um, this piece applies pressure to the tube as you unscrew it. This uh, collar here, if you unscrew that all the way off, um, you can see that um, this piece comes all the way through the brass molding here and it's got this drill truck chuck for lack of better terms that fits right in the housing like that so when you screw this collar down it, you know it applies pressure to the pin and that's what really holds the pin super solid like I, I try it a lot and I can't get the pin to move so I'm gonna screw this back together here like this and I actually really like the offset like the differentiating colors just makes it look really cool um, so I'm going to take my device here and I'm just going to open the jaw and I'm going to put that flange in just like that and um, I mean you can see it doesn't it just does not want to move it's in there pretty pretty doggone good it uh, comes with these two pins it comes with a large pin and a smaller pin the largest pin um, the outside diameter of this end piece the plug is what I'll call it um, actually ends up being a half of a centimeter so you could use tubes up to a half of a centimeter with um, the internal diameter uh, that equates to about one-fifth of an inch it's slightly just slightly a little bit smaller than one-fifth of an inch but that's pretty close um, so to just give you an idea, a reference, this tube is a middle of a Q-tip. Um, so it's a Q-tip tube that I cut the swabs off. I'm going to put the larger pin in there. And then I'm going to slide that right in the end here. And it goes right through like that. I'm going to just, just snug it up. Now I'm going to tighten down the drill chuck. Now this pin does not move. I mean, I can move the whole vise with it. It's really in there. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to simply rotate this. Oh, here, we'll make it a little more snug. Loosen that back out, tap it back in there, tighten that up. I'm just going to tighten this by rotating this collar towards me. And that's going to push this tube up against the rubber in here and now that tube does not spin so it's uh, just super easy to get your thread started on there um, without any issue whatsoever uh, it does not spin or whatever so overall I'm just thrilled to death with this little adapter um, I'm sure I'm gonna get a ton of use out of it and I'm really looking forward to fishing flies tied with the Stonefo adapter.